Okay, so uh, AR can be calculated by uh, simply putting the formula or it is also equal to price then the marginal revenue as we already know that marginal revenue is the change in the total revenue MR at n is equal to TR at n minus TR at n minus 1 so here it would be 10 then 8 6 4 2 0 minus 2 okay, you can uh, simply see that without calculating I wrote it uh, the marginal revenue because uh, you should know that marginal revenue will decline at twice the rate of average revenue. Uh, simply understand, see AR is decreasing by 1, MR is decreasing by 2. Again AR is decreasing by 1, MR will decrease by 2. Same. Right? The first thing that to, uh, you observe. Uh, one more important thing here you can see that TR is rising. At the initial stage TR rises then it reaches its maximum point this is the maximum point I can mark this as the maximum point and then it starts declining right we also see that it is maximum when MR is 0 and it starts declining when MR becomes negative so this is similar to quite similar to the relation between TU and MU and when we will draw the diagram then also you will observe it is similar relation On the x-axis we have the output sold y-axis shows TR, AR and MR so here both MR and AR will be downward sloping you can see both are downward sloping both are decreasing when output is increasing or you can simply say uh, it other way round that output can be increased only by decreasing the price so AR is downward sloping and similarly MR, MR is also downward sloping then we also saw that when MR is 0 then TR is maximum so same you can draw a dotted line like this then your TR should be maximum at this point and then it should start diminishing right or you can call it TR will be inverse U shaped. The points that you have to remember under this uh, relation, the certain points that you have to write. First thing that you observe is that here TR is inverse U shaped. First it rises, reaches a maximum, and then starts declining. Second, uh, both AR and MR are downward sloping. Then MR is twice as steep as AR. Twice as steep means that the slope of MR is more. Okay, because MR is declining at twice the rate of AR so quickly it will decline slope is more or steepness is more why in AR the steepness is less or you can say the slope of AR is less because it is declining at a slower rate so this question may be I'll put uh, in, uh, in front of you in, during the exam that why this happens individually also it can be asked so you should remember that it happens because MR decreases at twice the rate of AR then we also observe that TR rises till MR is positive TR is maximum when MR is 0 and TR starts declining when MR is negative right? so these are the important points that you need to mention when you are explaining the relation between TR, AR and MR under the imperfect market it may be asked in form of a schedule then you can frame a schedule like this just you have to decrease the price and multiply and calculate all the AR, TR, AR and MR you will automatically get the schedule uh, then uh, if it is asked in the form of a diagram this curve, this graph needs to be drawn and these points to be mentioned right?